got the X, I got the X, maybe you thought you won. Hey guys, just before this video starts, if any of you guys are looking to buy or sell any cheap Rocket League credits, blueprints, items, basically anything you want, AOEAH is a third party website that buys and sells Rocket League items. If you want to check it out, use the link in the description and use code XYZ on your checkout for 6% off your order. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, this is our third day in a row of daily uploads. I know, wow, I am deciding to finally get together a daily upload schedule um don't know how long this is gonna last so enjoy it while it, uh while you can and today i just figured i'm just gonna kind of talk about the daily upload schedule just open up some crates i really don't even know what i'm going for here but we're just gonna open up some crates and talk it's gonna be a pretty chill laid back episode where we get some exotics in the first crate thought they were gonna be painted for a second but it's all right um so basically let me get, uh, let me know guys in the comments um what kind of videos you guys want to see because obviously um the stuff i do with crates trade-ups non-crate very rare trade-ups uh non-crate import trade-ups and then blueprint trade-ups that's only so much i can do with that i need more ideas to be fueled to me through you guys um so, if anyone has genuine, new, original ideas. Now, I don't want people saying ideas that YouTubers have already said, because I don't know how many times people have told me, do a fashion show on my Discord. And I'm like, guys, I had this idea when it was popping off in Fortnite. So did Zenic. He beat me to it. I'm not going to step on his toes. I'm, I'm not going to take someone else's content that they're already doing and just copy it. But then again, I'm a crate opening YouTuber, so who am I to talk? But still, when when someone else clearly has a thing that they're doing, I don't want to just try and jump in and take that idea. So, if you guys actually have genuine, original ideas, um, my link to my Discord is in the description. There is a hashtag video ideas channel that I read all of them. I, I do. Even though 99% of them are all just concepts of either someone else's video that they just recently watched and they're just wanting me to do it or it's just hey you should do this thing where you give all of your fans free white zombas yeah people just want free stuff and are trying to milk me of everything i own um so yeah if you have actually a good idea i would love to hear it in my discord server in the comments wherever it might be i will try to be reading it and um obviously if i if someone gives me an idea i will give them credit if you give me an idea, I will mention you in the intro of the video and say, this is your idea. Like, I didn't come up with this. I'm completely straightforward with that kind of stuff. Um, and another thing, I mean, weekly videos, or I guess I'm going to try to make it like a weekly schedule or cycle now where I kind of do, like once a week, I'll do like a non-create barrier trade-up video. Like, you know, get some painted octanes, maybe get a white octane. Stuff like that, you know, once a week, maybe twice a week, I'll do some crate opening content, um, that kind of stuff. Uh, Hunt for Striker Black Dices, I want to bring those back each week now, um, now that I can. Um, as in, I'm able to get non-crate imports a lot more easily, I have better access to them, as you could say. Um, what else was I going to do each week? I covered those four. Oh, um, blueprint trade-ups from import to exotic, you know, get some titanium white... Uh, Zombas, Dracos, that kind of stuff, and then also exotic to black market blueprint trade-ups. I'm probably gonna do some of those. Um, you guys seem to enjoy those challenge videos I did where it was like, hey, I'm just gonna sit down and do trade-ups until I get a white black market, and when I do, I'm giving it to one of you guys. You guys seem to enjoy those. I've done, I think, two of them so far, and you guys enjoyed them quite a bit. Um, so yeah, I guess Check the comments right now for any new suggestions, and then make sure to like the comments that are suggestions you actually would want to see yourself, um, because the, the easiest way to get me to see your comment, although in the first like 24 hours of a video being released, I typically read all the comments, I try to anyways, I guess in the first like 20 hours I will, but if you check the comments and you see someone su suggested something, and you're like, hey, that'd actually be really awesome to watch, I'd love to see that. Hit a like on their comment. That's all you gotta do, and that that way it has a better chance of me seeing it in the future. Um, but yeah, we are on day three of daily uploads. I don't even know what I'm going for here. Um, we're only like four minutes in, so I'm probably just gonna hang out and talk for a bit. 
I am... We it's weird for me. I'm very tired right now, but I'm also extremely energetic. It, is, is that like a normal thing? I, I don't know. Um, I guess we'll just open crates till we get a black market. Which, as you guys may or may not know, actually, I should cover the giveaways that I have that are running right now. Like, usually, every YouTuber just slap those, slaps those in the first 30 seconds of their video. Um, I'm a bit delayed on that, I'm sorry. Uh, in my Discord server, link in the description, I have a free Titanium White Octane giveaway, um, and a Party Time Goal Explosion giveaway. Uh, the Party Time is for any platform, so anyone from any platform that wants to win that, they can. And then the Titanium White Octane, um, it's it's on PC, it's hard to, I mean, you can't, you can't cross-platform trade, um, so that is a PC giveaway only. But, I mean... The, uh, the party time black market is for all consoles. All platforms, I guess. Yeah. I think I worded that properly. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but let me know, guys. What are your thoughts on the new beach ball uh, um, mode? I saw, that, I saw that update today hit and uh, released. I heard people were saying it was pretty good. I haven't personally gotten a chance to play it. It's, um, it's nighttime of the day that the beach, the beach volleyball game mode released. Uh, I'm trying to pre-record, you know, a couple days early um, for videos just so I can, you know, get on track, get ready, because Mother Day, Mother's Day is in a few days. For those of you that forgot, and I know you did, um, get, get your mom a present or something. Um, I already did pretty good. I made sure I was on time this year, and I wasn't doing stuff last minute. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm probably not going to be on much uh, this Sunday for that reason. Um, so I'm just trying to get a couple days ahead, and also it's always good to just be ahead of the schedule for everything, so I'm just trying to get in a cycle where, you know, I'm recording like one or two videos a day, I'm doing well, I'm doing bits. The past two days, the only video games I have played is Rocket League, and I have only played it to record videos and do trading to get a lot of non-trade, very rares, stuff like that. I have not actually, like, wasted time in the past two days. Actually, no, that's that's wrong. I've watched a lot of Parks and Rec on Netflix, and I'm halfway through watching Infinity War, but I haven't wasted video game time. I've not wasted time on video games, for once. Ever since this corona break started, I was just wasting all my time playing video games, which, I mean, hey, the, everything is good, um, but it needs to be in, uh, there needs to be a limit on it. Like I, I played too much, and then I was getting behind on videos, and it was just, it was just not good. So I'm trying to pick up the pace now. Figured, hey, no better way to pick up the pace than to completely revamp everything, make it daily uploads. And if if these videos start doing really well, like if my channel starts doing better for posting daily content, hey, you guys will see a lot more of me now, and a lot more giveaways, obviously. So if you're new here. If you're one of the 36% of people that aren't subscribed that watch my videos, hit that subscribe button. I'd love to have you on the channel. And uh, we're close to hitting 60k subs. And also, I, I've mentioned it a couple times in older videos, but if you don't know, if I hit 100,000 subscribers by the end of 2020, I will be doing a, uh, a tournament in-game. Um, it's my own special mode, my own mutators, so I'm not leaking what any of that is yet. Uh, it's my own fun mode, and I will be giving away 100,000 credits to the winner for 100,000 subs. Figured that's just a fun little event that I can do. Oh, that's a lot of credits. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Um, but yeah, we're, <laughs> we're giving away 100,000 credits for that. Um, if we can hit it by the end of the year. So that's a little bit of a challenge for you guys. Um, and if you want to try and hit it, I mean, hey, send, send these videos to all your friends that play Rocket League. You know, tell them, hey, if you subscribe, there's going to be 100,000 credits in a tournament by the end of the year. That'll be pretty fun. It's going to be it's going to be very interesting to coordinate. Um, I'm going to talk with some other streamers and uh, another Discord um, that I know has hosted a lot of um, community tournaments and stuff like that to just kind of get a little bit of expertise um, of how they have ran things. Um, and probably I'll get some help with it as well, running it, because trying to coordinate something like that is not going to be very easy. Um, but yeah, it, it will happen if we hit 100k by the end of the year. I'm just saying. You can, you can save this video, you can do whatever, I will not go back on what I said. 
Especially since I'm getting some Balakara wheels from Psionics. Okay, we haven't gotten anything good. We're almost at 10 minutes. You guys know I, I need that ad revenue. No, I'm just kidding. I don't even care about ad revenue these days. Like, with all the corona stuff that's been happening, ad rates have been... If I'm being honest. So, I'm here to just have fun. Which is... This is really weird to me. I'm just realizing. I'm taking the one time where the ad rates are, like, complete trash to actually, like, post a bunch. Why am I doing this? Why am I... I don't know. I'm a very... I'm, I'm probably the smartest idiot, idiot you're, you're ever going to meet. Or I'm just the dumbest intellect you'll ever meet. You can pick one. I'm one or the other. I think I'm the smartest idiot you'll ever meet. But hey, who knows? We'll see. Um, and also, brand new topper I've been rocking. The, uh, the Crimson Mohawk. Honestly, it's one of my favorite toppers to ever release. The Mohawk. Uh, second to the foam hat, obviously. Um... But this is a nice one that's not too big. It's clean. I can put it on my Octane. I got a nice build with the Lime Octane and the Lime Dune Racer. And I put a dark uh, dark red to match. And then black is the secondary to match the bottom of the Mohawk as well. I just can't wait till we get the black Mohawk. When the black painted Mohawk releases in the shop, I am buying it instantly. Because that is going to be such a good item to buy. It's going to look so clean. It's going to match everything. Every single car I design will have a black mohawk on it after it releases. If it releases. I mean, who knows? There's plenty of items that haven't been released yet into the item shop, like, um, white mainframe. I don't think that's even hit the shop yet. I was actually kind of surprised. I was looking because I was like, has white mainframe not hit the shop? Like, I was talking with uh, some of my friends and we actually, like, took, like, a good hour to go back and look at all the item shops and... To our knowledge, it, it never hit the item shop. And I even like looked it up on YouTube. I was scrolling through YouTube videos. I typed in like white mainframe item shop. And I know there's some YouTubers that just review like whenever anything crazy hits the item shop. And there was no videos about white mainframe hitting the item shop. And I'm just kind of surprised because white mainframe is a really valuable item in the trading economy right now. And you'd think Psyonix would try to just uh, chuck that in the item shop get a bunch of money. I mean, it's what they did with the White Zombas. They threw them up in there with the White Dominus. I'm pretty sure they paired them together. And, uh, they made bank. <laughs> Apologies, guys. My allergies had to sneeze and blow my nose. I'm back. So, yeah. Just figured I'd cut that out, because I doubt you want to see that in the video. It's just kind of weird if I left that in there. Um, but yeah. I don't even know what I'm opening crates up for anymore. I'll probably just stop when I get like a painted exotic or like a black market or something at this point. We're just hanging out, we're vibing, we're, we're chilling. <sighs> How's everybody been doing on the Rona break? Have you guys been getting a ton of schoolwork? Have, I know a lot of people are getting their college exams right now um, from talking to a lot of my friends. As a senior in high school, all I gotta worry about is AP tests pretty much. That's like basically it. Um, a few scholarships. Other than that, I mean, there's not much work to be done. That's why I've been hitting this pretty hard. Oh, Titanium White Dracos. Great way to end off the video, actually. Wow. It has been a while since I got those from a crate. I did not even know they had Titanium White Dracos in this crate when I picked it. I just picked this because it had mainframes. And I was like, hey, maybe I'll get a painted mainframe. But Titanium White Dracos, not a bad pull at all. Thank you guys all for watching. I will see you guys next time. Peace out.